Mother Nature more than five million years to carve out the Grand Canyon. So the five years or so it took to build a railroad from the frontier town of Williams to the rim was just a tiny blip in the canyon's long geological timeline. Yet the railroad made a seismic impact on this rugged corner of northern Arizona, bringing visitors for the first time to explore one of the most dramatic landscapes on Earth. Back in the late 19th and early 20th centuries, engine drivers like Casey Jones were the pinup boys of the pioneering West. But the glamour of train journeys ran out of steam when America fell in love with the motor car tanked up along Route 66. Now, gas and the motor car are on the way to being consigned to history. Trains are back on track in a modern, more eco-friendly world. And we're rediscovering the fun of traveling by locomotive. The trains are becoming environmentally sustainable. A new generation of railroad engineers is transforming the legendary Grand Canyon Railway into one of the greenest steam trains in the world. Railroad company Zantera bought the line in 2007 and since then has adapted the old steam engines to run on recycled chip fat. Going from coal, a nasty, dirty fossil fuel, to a clean, 100% renewable fuel, uh, really shows that we're serious about our commitment to the environment. We collect the kitchen grease from our restaurants here in Williams and at the Grand Canyon. We can then put it into our steam engine and burn it as a fuel. It's a much cleaner burning fuel as opposed to diesel fuel. Reducing carbon emissions is a global priority. But there's another local reason why it's important to cut fossil fuel use at the Grand Canyon, and that's the view. The haze that sometimes masks the horizon is not natural cloud, but pollution from cars and power stations as far away as the West Coast. Water is also a big issue in this arid corner of northern Arizona. So the railway harvests 90,000 gallons of snow melt and rainwater every year to produce steam in its veteran engines. Looking after the environment is vital for the survival of wildlife within the Grand Canyon National Park. The park is home to many Native American species of plants and animals. Hiking in the canyon, you might catch a glimpse of a bobcat, elk, and bear. Running a train company is always going to be a work in progress. The next step will be to convert the company's modern diesel engines so they're able to run on recycled vegetable oil. And there are still problems along the line, like getting rid of those rustling, good-for-nothing robbers that board the train on the way back to Williams.